Jesus ran across people like that in the, when he was here. But some of them got changed, didn't they? Amen. That could be you tonight. Just as, just as it was any of them. Some of you may not know this, but there was a woman in the Bible. True story now. <laughs> she had went to doctors. The Bible said she spent every, all the money that she had, she spent it trying to get better. And that describes some people. But she wasn't getting any better. She's getting worse. But one day she heard of Jesus and she heard some good things. People were touching him, you know, getting whole, made whole. And, and God was healing them. So she determined in herself and said, that's what's going to happen to me. Was she healed then? Uh-uh. No. Nope. No different then than she ever was. See, some people get got this thing backwards. They say, well, when God heals me, I'll be healed. If God wants me well, he'll, he'll heal me. What about her? What about her? And so she said in herself, maybe that's what you're going to have to do. Maybe you're going to have to say, you know what? If I look to Jesus, he'll heal me. He'll deliver me. Hmm? Praise God. He will. Praise God. And so that's what happened to her. Then she came to Jesus and with her faith and touched his garment. And she was healed just like that. Bam. <laughs> you can get healed just like that. That's why I say that. People, people they kind of make fun of that. You can be healed just like that. I don't know about that. Listen, is that pretty quick? She was. Doctors worked on her a long time, but you know how much time she spent going back and forth and to and all of her money? Strange, isn't it? But get Jesus involved. And it was quick. And the virtue flowed out of it. She knew in herself right then, I'm healed. <laughs> I think that's awesome. And I'm saying all that because that can happen to you. You want off those drugs, you want off of those just all this old junk that's going on. You want out of it? He'll be the way out. He's the way. He'll let you out. He'll get you out. Praise God. If you want out. Now, if you have need for prayer, you call in. We'll pray for you. I don't like drugs no way. I'd be happy to come against them. I'll be happy to use my faith for you. Are you hearing? Are you tired of drinking? Well, you might need to call in and say, hey, pray for me. We will. We'll pray for you. We prayed for that sister this morning, too. If she was to be watching tonight, I hope she is. I won't mention any names. Called your prayer request in this morning. I believe God's doing things for you. Praise God. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. This person called in a couple Sundays ago, and we prayed for this. Ain't no glory to me. Glory to God. And said within 30 seconds, God come in that room and healed her. 
I praise God for that, you know. Uh, we, we need to get to the place to where we're just more believers than we are anything else. We just receive the Word of God more than we, we receive anything else. You can be there. It takes some effort to get there. It takes pushing some aside and letting some in. And if you if you just believe what God says, His Word is so. And the other stuff, you push it aside. You keep it out. And you don't let it in.